Hello, this is day three of uh, practicing the theme of the uh, Sestric Opus 3 variations. Um, and I watched Vivian Hoffmann's original uh, video on that uh, from I don't know, May or June. And uh, I had the original plan of practicing <laughs> continuous vibrato with that, but her suggestions are all about the bow. So I see uh, that I follow uh, her practice tips and uh, see if I can maybe next week also address vibrato, or if not, I do it with uh, another piece. So, um, one uh, idea of practicing this is um, uh, proper bow changes with uh, enough um, finger action, perhaps. Or, mm, it's, um, yeah. The way I've been learning bow changes is not really with finger action, but with uh, just getting in and out of the bow at the same speed, at the same direction, without doing anything extra with the fingers. But of course, uh, it's good if the fingers have some kind of passive movement. And to develop that, the suggestion was to do the fingerstrich um, uh, in the middle of the bow. it for a longer time so uh, I mean I crawled up uh, by elongating the up bows and um, in the beginning I noticed I did that with the arms so it should be only be done with the fingers but then eventually I be at the frog and then I have to practice it for a longer time and then I crawl up to the tip and repeat there where it is normally easier so I'm starting again let's see maybe on the D string was to play this uh, uh, slower and uh, maybe just the empty strings with um, uh, taking care of the, the um, string changes particularly so these should um, 
be done the strength changes um, like uh, double stops so I don't really have to follow the music here I can just do um, some patterns so I'm putting the metronome to 40 for the half notes let's see fingers in the up bow so there is some finger movement and then at the, at the concrete at the uh, split second of the of the change I don't do anything special with fingers and then I I, I straighten them out again so something like that the bow actually for the mezzo forte dynamics notes and I'm put 
pushing this a little bit faster, like um, 50, 50 for the half note beat. So um, there are the string changes from um, C to A, with A for singer on the D string, and these are <laughs> the most difficult double stops in the um, double stop repertoire for me because of the low um, uh, second finger. So uh, I have to practice these uh, separately. So today it's already 10 minutes or more, so I'll come back to that tomorrow. Bye for now.